If you have receipted in stock with the incorrect batch number, you are able to correct it using the stock adjustment functionality, which is found under the inventory and transactions menus. Firstly, you would create an adjustment to adjust out the incorrectly receipted stock. So here, we can enter our sweetheart's candy and decrease the stock by entering a negative symbol in front of the quantity. Once we add that line, it will prompt us to select the batch number and the number of units impacted. So we can add the 10 units here. You can then complete that stock adjustment and do take note of the stock adjustment number as we will need to reference it in the second part of this process. Next, we will create a second stock adjustment to bring that stock back in with a correct batch number. So again, let's enter in our Sweetheart's candy product and then increase our stock by those 10 units. You can then use the comments field to refer to the first stock adjustment. Once we add that line, it will prompt us to enter the new batch number, its expiry date and the quantity, which would be our 10 units in this example. You can then click add batch. Please note, that the value of the goods adjusted in needs to match the value of the goods adjusted out. You can then go ahead and complete the stock adjustment. By doing this, you have allocated those goods to the correct batch number. Thank you for watching.